Students from the Freshman Academy at Stratford STEM Magnet High School in Nashville visited Old Hickory Dam on the Cumberland River February 27, 2014, where they met with U.S. Army Corps of Engineers Nashville District experts to learn about the various purposes of the district's projects, which include flood damage reduction, hydropower, navigation, water quality, water supply, fish and aquatic life, and recreation. We guarantee that the navigation channel will be at least nine feet deep and it'll be at least 300 feet wide. So that commercial navigation, towboats pushing barges, for example, can make their way through. So you can see a lot of commerce has moved um, through these waterways. The students split into two groups and flip-flop between classroom instruction and a tour of the lock where students were able to see a six-barge tow locked through while navigating its way downstream. For one student, the chance to visit with core members and to see the lock up close was a great learning experience. It's really like fun learning how all this works and everything and seeing this. A water manager, biologist, and park rangers interacted with the students and explained how the core produces hydropower, manages the water, and serves as stewards of the environment at the 10 lakes operated by the Nashville District. The instructional designer from the school said the topics covered and being able to see the barges at the lock served as a great introduction for the ninth graders to learn about interdisciplinary science, research, and engineering pathway. So our project that we're working on that puts together engineering and scientific research is a study of the water quality of Cooper Creek, which is part of the watershed of Stratford High School. So the students are here becoming informed about our watershed and our Cooper Creek, of course, flows into the Cumberland River and of course the Corps of Engineers is managing the flood management and the navigation and the water quality. So we're here to find out what real engineers and real scientists do because that's really what we're trying to do is develop a real world, real application project for the students. At the conclusion of the visit, the students learned about water safety and wearing life jackets and also about the many opportunities available in the Corps of Engineers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics fields. This is Lee Roberts reporting for the Nashville District at Old Hickory Dam in Old Hickory, Tennessee.